Guys, I want to give you the five key principles to building strength and muscle with kettlebells. This is the Pat Flynn Show. I'm Pat Flynn. Let's get started. So the first key to building strength and muscle with kettlebells is to learn proper technique. Safety and performance are never at odds. The positions where you're safest are the positions where you're strongest, always. So take the time to learn to swing with a flat back, to squat with your knees tracking your toes. It's these subtle but ever important nuances that are going to keep you injury free and moving forward. So the second key principle to gaining strength and muscle with kettlebells is to focus on the big fundamental human movements. Push, pull, hinge, squat, carry. Bigger movements are better movements. So instead of bicep curls, do bent over rows. Instead of tricep extensions, military press. These movements are going to have the highest degree of neuromuscular facilitation and the greatest strength carryover. Guys, the third key principle to building strength and muscle with kettlebells is to keep the weight high, but the reps low. Now, in order to gain strength, we don't have to lift heavy all the time, but we do have to lift heavy some of the time. Now, heavy is a relative term. What's heavy for me may not be heavy for you or the other way around. So you want to be challenged within your ability and progressing over time to a heavier load. So the fourth key to gaining strength and muscle with kettlebells is to quickly progress to the double kettlebell movements. I don't mean rush into it. Still spend as much time as you need, I usually recommend one to three months, mastering the fundamental techniques with one kettlebell. Swing, goblet squat, Turkish get up, military press. But when you're good with that and you wanna be aggressive about chasing strength, you need to move on to moves like the front squat and double clean and press that are going to allow you to move a greater amount of load and add more intensity to your workouts. The final key to gaining strength and muscle with kettlebells has nothing to do with kettlebells. It's making sure that you're getting enough rest. Recovery is the key to results. And one of the most common problems that I see with people who are trying to gain strength but not quite succeeding is they aren't resting enough. The truth is you really only need about three to four days a week 20 to 60 minutes at a time to develop a really powerful amount of strength. Anything more than that may be overkill or it may also mean that you're not lifting heavy enough. Guys, those were my five key principles to gaining strength and muscle with kettlebells. I hope you found this video helpful. If you think somebody else might enjoy it, please pass it along. I'm Pat Flynn and we'll see you next time.